What's up guys, it's February 26th. I'm here at Manila Airport because I'm flying to Cebu City today. So I'm only planning to be in Cebu City for one night and tomorrow I'm heading further south in Cebu Island. I'm about 80% sure that, of my, that I know where I'm going but I'm gonna figure that out for sure tonight. What's up guys? It's February 27th, the next day. This is my hostel back here, La Village here in Cebu City. I'm actually gonna leave, so I haven't even unpacked my bag. I'm just gonna get some breakfast first. Guess I'm trying a Filipino style breakfast. Mm -hmm. Just got some random things, but they look yeah. good. Just checked out of my hostel, and you know how I said yesterday that I was 80% sure of where I was going today? That 80% sure place that I was going to, I'm not going to anymore. At least not for now. I'm gonna go to the pier and take a boat to the island of Bohol. Okay, I just bought my ticket to Tagbilaran, which is a port of entry for the island of Bohol. And it cost me 500 pesos, so around $10. And now I'm here in the terminal, I just went through the security process and all that. So now I'm just gonna wait for my boat, which leaves at one, less than an hour. Worth noting that there was a terminal fee of 25 pesos and a check baggage fee of 50 pesos. Not too much. to Pablo Island, which is a smaller part of Bohol. So I just arrived in my hostel in Alona Beach. I have a four person dorm. It's not exactly cheap, but it's, there's not a ton of options. Uh, this, this area is not as touristy. So Alona Beach is part of Paglao Island, which is a smaller uh, island connected by a bridge to Bohol, and it belongs to the province of Bohol. And I'd seen it in some of the travel vlogs that I follow from other bigger travel vloggers, and it looks really cool. And tomorrow I'll probably be doing a day trip and rent a motorbike to go further north into Bohol and there's some really cool stuff to see. But for now, I'm just gonna chill around here and head to the beach pretty soon. All right, I'm heading to the beach now. It's already past 4 p.m., but I haven't had lunch, so I'm gonna find a place to get lunch on the way to the beach, and then I'll head to the beach to enjoy the sunset. What a beautiful beach. That sand is like almost white, and the water is amazing. Nice. Found a good spot for lunch. Great food. Now let's sit by this beach and enjoy the sunset. What a beautiful beach. The temperature of the water is perfect. The sand is fine as powder. It's awesome. I'm glad I came here. It was like a last minute decision I made last night and I'm really glad I made that decision. My first day out of the city in the Philippines but I love this country already. I have to say, if you come to the Philippines, I 100% recommend coming to Bohol just for a lonely beach alone. And I think tomorrow we'll see more reasons why you should come to Bohol. What's up guys, it is now the next day, February 28th. I'm gonna go out and rent a motor scooter so I can ride further up into the island of Bohol to do some sightseeing so you guys can see what Bohol has to offer. Quick pit stop here just to show you this church. I'm gonna cross the bridge to get out of Taglao Island and into the much larger Bohol Island. 
and that's where we're gonna see some really cool stuff. So let's get going. Okay, I'm much further into the island of Bohol and the first really scenic uh, stop it's kind of something you just pass through. It's a man-made forest. Check it out. So cool. Okay, I just arrived at the first legit stop. It's called Tarsier Conservation Park. Tarsiers are these tiny little mammals that live in the trees, so this is a park that tries to conserve the species and they're really tiny so hopefully we can spot some. They really try as well. We found one here. We have to be silent because they get really stressed out and they can actually die from stress easily. So that's why the signs are saying that. So tiny. You sure love to hide. I've come to know where to expect to find them. Well, that was it. It was a short visit. They're so tiny, and yeah, it's really unique animals. Glad I came here. Just making a quick stop for a late lunch before I move on to my last spot for today. Okay, we're just about here. Welcome to the Chocolate Hills. Okay, I just arrived at the Chocolate Hills complex. There was a toll of 50 pesos, and then I drove part of the way up the hill, and then the final part is 220 steps that I just walk up. First viewpoint, check this out. See the views at the top now. All right, here we go. Look like Hershey's Kisses. Alright, it's been nice, but I'm gonna make my way now because the ride back will probably take like two hours. Definitely won't be back before dark, so it's time to head back. Back at the hostel, and man, I am tired of being on a motor scooter today. But it was a really cool day, and a good couple of days here in Bohol. Tomorrow, I'm moving on to a different place in the Philippines. Won't be too far away from here, but I'm looking forward to it. So I'm gonna end the vlog here, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Good night.